We're going to start with your waist measurement. In order to get this measurement, you're gonna wrap your measuring tape around your body, just right above your belly button. And you want it to be comfortable, so don't pull it too tight. For reference, I will be making this skirt in a size small, and my waist measurement is 27 inches. Now because acrylic yarn is stretchy, I usually make my waistband a little bit smaller than my actual waist size. So what I do is take my waist measurement, which is 27, and I subtract seven inches from that. So if you want your waistband to stretch onto you rather than fitting exactly and risk it being a little bit too big, you're gonna take your waist measurement and subtract seven. All right, now that you have your waist measurement, we're going to start the waistband of your skirt. This waistband is worked very simple. You only really need to know one stitch. So you're gonna start with your slip knot and insert your hook. And then we're gonna chain up nine plus one. Now we do this because your 10th chain, which is your plus one, actually will not count. We will be skipping that first chain. So the width of your waistband will only be nine stitches. Now that you've finished your 10 chains, we're going to skip the first one and half double crochet into the remaining nine. Now I'm on my last half double crochet here, and once you get to the end of the row, you're just gonna chain one and turn. All right, now this next row is gonna be worked in the back loops only. So the loop closest to you is the front loop, and the loop furthest from you is the back loop. So we're going to work into the back loop of the half double crochet for your next row. And you see me here crocheting over my tail of yarn. That's just so that I don't have to weave it in later. You can do that too if you'd like. You just have to drape your tail right over those Vs and make sure it's in the middle of your stitch when you're crocheting back down the row. But like I said, now we have nine stitches in your width of your waistband. So we're just gonna half double crochet nine stitches down. So your repeat for your waistband length is going to be chain one, turn, and half double crochet in the back loops only for nine stitches. You're gonna keep doing this until you reach the length of your waist minus seven. Next, you're gonna flip your waistband, chain one, and fold it in half just like I have so that we can connect both ends together. This skirt will be worked in the round. So I've decided to actually just go through the side closest to me and then the side farthest from me and single crochet down that row. 